Right, so now we have a siskin, and a siskin takes a, a smaller, smaller ring size than a great tit. It's a smaller bird. So we have a range of ring sizes for different species. Uh, not a, a different size for every species, but a range of sizes that fit all the, the Swedish birds. Hi, I'm Ian Henshaw. I work at the Swedish Bird Ring Centre at the Natural History Museum in Stockholm. And we give it a final squeeze to make sure it's there's no gap in the ring and it's fitted properly. It moves up and down. So number just check the number ninety two, yes. Date uh, zero eight. The time is ten. This one is a female. A male would have a, a dark black cap to the head and have would be a brighter green and yellow. This one's generally quite gre pale green and, and streaky in its plumage. So it's a female. And again, with this one, we can look at several characters to, to see if it's a, a bird that was hatched last year or an older bird. In some cases, we can use the shape of the tail feathers. So in, in birds that were hatched last year, they would have a more pointed shape to the tip of the tail feather, and an older bird which was hatched before last year, so say let's say 2020, would have a much rounder, broader uh, tip to the tail. But we can also look at, again, the wing feathers, and here we can see, not as easily, but a difference in the color of these feathers here. So these inner ones here are much blacker and glossier compared to these outer ones here, which are much more dull gray-black, sort of slightly brownish. So this one has one, two, three, four, five, six feathers, which it's kept from, from when it was hatched last year. So that's also second year bird. The wing is 71. Fat. Fat three. Not a lot of fat. Three we'll call it. I'd say it was this this score here. Fat three. The more fat they have, it, the, the easier it can be to see when, it, when you see more yellow. In this case, it was still quite pink, so it, the fat layer probably wasn't very deep, uh, very thick. But if it had no fat at all, it would, it, the, the, you'd see through the skin that it'd be quite dark red, whereas this was very pinky red. Fat, fat and weight give us some idea of the, the bird's condition. Um, in winter, birds are often they have to eat as much as possible in order to sort of survive the night because it's very cold. So they eat as much as they can during the day and store that, that as fat so they can sort of burn that up during the night to keep warm. So birds that have come to feed us, like I have here, often have quite a lot of fat when it's quite cold. So I'm taking it quite slowly now to show you the birds as I'm ringing, but normally within ringing like this you probably take no more than a minute uh, to ring a bird, probably even a bit less. So it usually goes very quickly. Final thing is to weigh it. 11.7 grams. So we have everything on this bird. So you can uh, fly away and uh, carry on feeding. <laughs>